welcome back to my channel and now i'm going to watch kimito boku no saiko no senjo episode 6 so let's check it out Yeah, that's uh, Alice. Ah, okay, this is from the previous episode when she was holding his Kaskan. Okay, I can understand that in the previous episode, she really wants to meet Iska. <laughs> okay, and we got another Sundere. Arranging a battle? Keep visiting that city! <laughs> yeah, I wonder, are they really going to fight if they meet again? Uh, meet each other again in that neutral city? Okay, about the previous episode, so both sides are trying to reach the vortex. Okay, and I think uh, the astral mage uh, managed to reach uh, the vortex uh, first. And also, uh, there is a traitor inside the Imperial, which is uh, Noro. And also, I remember that Alice was fighting with Nameless, uh, Commander Nameless, uh, in the previous episode, and that Nameless is so powerful. And also, when uh, Miss Miss fell into the vortex, Iska tried to save her and then uh, Alice uh, was saving both Iska and Miss Miss too. Okay, so I'm glad that uh, all of them survived from that falling and okay, they got separated again. Yeah, I can see that in the previous episode, Alice really wants to meet Iska. <laughs> okay, she even went to the enemy's camp just to find Iska. Okay, she keeps saying that she wants a fight with Iska, but okay, I don't think she's going to fight him if uh, she manages to find him. Okay, so let's see. Uh, Rin said that uh, they should visit the neutral city again, so maybe there's a chance that Iska visit that city too, so they can meet each other again. be captured by Shenorut. <laughs> yeah, that's why uh, she got her point reduced. And yeah, no one knows that uh, Shenorut has been spying the Imperial for for so for so long. Yeah, I mean, from the beginning, yeah, I thought. Uh, the real Noro was being killed by Shenorod. It uh, turns out Shenorod uh, is Noro from the beginning. Feels weird. Capture Queen Nebulis. Okay, uh, yeah, that's not easy. Yeah, even though the members of these units are talented, but. Uh, <laughs> Uh, they cannot uh, capture Queen Nebula so easily.
Okay, so the weather is very hot now. <laughs> it's been three days and they are still waiting here for Iska's existence. Come on, she just missed him. So stop saying that she's going to fight him. And I want to search this whole city. But she's busy looking for Iska. Ah, yes, Orin will never support her. It's a bug bite. Okay, I don't think it's a normal wound. Maybe it's uh, the after effect of uh, falling into that vortex. Oh, what is that? A tattoo? It's definitely not a bug bite. It's like a symbol. Okay, how did she get that? It's not a bug bite! <laughs> Okay, maybe she was being chosen by the vortex or something when she fell into that vortex. Okay, she looks so scared. Suitable horse. Oh, okay, I hope nothing bad will happen to Miss Miss. She will become a witch. Okay, maybe we should hide this fact from the higher ups. <gasps> Be executed. Turn yourself in. Okay, the unit won't be the same again without Miss Miss.
and she's crying after knowing that uh, her subordinates really care about her. And that's Alice. Okay, I think she is about to give up. <laughs> she still won't give up. She still want to visit that ain city to find Iska. Okay, look at Rin's face. <laughs> Maybe we should cover it up with uh, a tattoo. <gasps> oh, yeah, we just had an incident with Shannon, so okay, they will execute uh, any astral mage that uh, that is found in this uh, imperial army. Okay, so Iska and Miss Miss are in aim now. Hmm, okay, let me guess. So maybe this is the good time for Alice to find Iska. Actually, both Iska and Alice just want to end this war, but uh, it seems that both Assel Mage and also the Imperial uh, cannot negotiate and create peace for uh, for this world, so they keep fighting against each other. Both of them are thinking the same about how to end this war. I think that's Alice.
Yeah, he's right behind you. <laughs> yeah, finally they hit each other again. Yeah, she was thinking about having fight with Iska. But now, okay, she's blushing and speechless. So they sit on the same bench. What's with that look? <gasps> oh, that's Rin! <laughs> She is giving him a dream with a cold face. Oh, where is Miss Miss? Damn, Rin put something inside that ring. Okay, I saw Iska was seeing Alice drink that uh drinks first and okay, he wants to make sure that nothing's wrong with that ring. But it okay, turns out Rin put something inside that ring. Sleep inducing drug. Yeah, I think Alice will be so pissed off. He's gonna let his guard down. Hey, give me to 
custody. <gasps> oh, okay, that's Miss Miss. Okay, the boss is back. Okay, that astral crest oh, is shining so bright. They don't care about Miss Miss and her astral crest. Oh, but I think that Alice is unhappy about this idea because now they are kidnapping Iska. In the natural city! Okay, that's the shadow of the emperor. Okay, he, he looks like an ordinary human. Okay, about this episode, I thought it's gonna be a relaxing episode, but okay, we got two surprising moments in this episode. The one is when suddenly uh, an astral crash uh, show up on uh, Miss Miss's arm. And the other one is, turns out Rin put some uh, sleeping drug uh, inside Iska's drink and he fell asleep and now uh, Alice and Rin were taking him as custody. Okay, this is bad because uh, actually I disagree about this because uh, they shouldn't do this kind of uh, crime in, in a natural city. And also, Miss Miss couldn't do anything to save Iska too. Okay, so let's just see what will happen in the next episode. But I hope that uh, they won't hurt Iska uh, in the Astral Mage Castle. Okay, so thank you guys for watching our video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And also support me on my Patreon. See you again in my next video. And take care. <music>